today we are going to talk primarily about SAP HANA Cloud Platform and the Fury apps, native Fury apps which we have available uh, and, and even give a demo of uh, one or two of those apps. So that's what Charter Global does um, at a high level. Uh, we are a solution company. Uh, we uh, work with uh, clients of different sizes and uh, we, we are uh, very, very focused on being a close partner uh, with our customers, helping them in transforming their business operations uh, uh, towards future. Thank you, Anil. And I want to encourage people to check out our website where we have numerous case studies about our, our Fortune 1000 clients as well as mid-sized companies and the various value we can offer. Okay, Anil, now I'm going to let you kind of take over and tell us about our innovative SAP Fiori solutions at a glance before we go a little more granular on each solution. Yes, uh, um, what is uh, really exciting and what really differentiates uh, our solutions uh, from solutions which are out there um, built by uh, various partners uh, is, is as follows. Uh, we are uh, purely building all our solutions on HANA Cloud. Uh, all our solutions uh, are native mobile apps. Uh, so as a customer, uh, you really don't need to uh, have a Fiori server on-premise. Uh, you don't need to move any of your core SAP uh, ERP system to cloud. You can continue to use that uh, as per the current installation. Uh, we use HANA Cloud Platform uh, as a compute unit, and the apps are deployed uh, to, uh, to a mobile device. Uh, and, and then uh, using the SAP HANA Cloud Connector, they uh, connect to your uh, on-premise system for your data as well as uh, identity authentication. So it is a very, very uh, cool way of deploying solutions, very fast and transparent. Uh, the implementation takes hardly few weeks, not man months. And uh, we have been building these solutions for last 18 months. Uh, and then now uh, they are ready for uh, uh, mass deployment for uh, multiple clients. Great. Uh, we we already have these solutions working at few of the clients uh, who work very closely with us uh, to build these solutions. I have a couple of so, questions. Um, yeah. So if I were to get the app, is it as it is out of the box or can I also customize it at all for my business? Yeah, very good question, uh, Tamara. So um, out of the box, we do have the uh, what I call the core 101 functionality available. Uh, at the same time, uh, we have got requests from customers that uh, the app is great, but can it uh, have some more fields which are critical to us? Yes. So uh, all those, uh, all those. Um, I call them modifications or enhancements are very much possible. Uh, the apps can be customized uh, to a specific customer need, uh, but the beauty is uh, the core engineering is already done. So any minor tweaks which a customer would want to have right. uh, would not take that long. So I assume that means this is much more cost effective and resource effective than rather trying to build it in-house yourself. We have the basis there and then we can modify it to your needs. Now I had also a quick reminder here if you are interested in the Fiori apps, um, I encourage you to get more information on our website about signing up for a free 30-day trial. Okay, with that, we're going to launch into the first sort of granular view of the first of our apps, and that is the PO Approval app, which from what I hear is has huge value for all SAP Fiori users. Uh, Anil, can you please jump in and tell us a little bit more about the solution and, and the kind of client value they would get from this? So our first use case uh, here is uh, the Purchase Order Approval app. Uh, so uh, what this app does uh, all the businesses uh, this is a very standard use case which is available to all of us 
uh, in businesses. Uh, we all uh, create purchase orders uh, in SAP ERP system. And those, uh, those particular purchase orders go through uh, an approval process as per uh, the company policy and procedures. What uh, we have done is we have built an app uh, which allows uh, the approvers to be notified immediately when we have a purchase order which needs an approval. So uh, the app uh, is, uh, is, is deployed on the HANA cloud platform. Uh, all you, it's a native app uh, which will reside on each and every approvers uh, handheld device, primarily a mobile device or an iPad, whatever be the case. Great. And, and um, then uh, the approval will be notified as soon as the purchase order is created in the SAP system that, hey, uh, you need to approve this purchase order. Okay. And um, then uh, you can go ahead and approve the purchase order from the device itself. So as I understand, this is a sort of a, a value because many people are out there using it and now they have it on their mobile device so they can quickly make a decision and move that order, that purchase order along and saving people time and money by um, moving that process along. Yes, yes, that is right. Uh, so um, this, this allows uh, most of the organizations to... Mm -hmm have the approval process very streamlined. Um, and we've seen a lot, lot of, of interest in this app. Um, we have uh, several requests of people already starting to use this. Let's move on to the next app so we can get to the actual demo of the PO approval app. So the next app right. we also offer is the Credit Hold Notifications app. Can you tell us a little bit about yes. this? Yes, yes, yes. So this, this particular app um, is on the uh, sales order side. Uh, uh, again, uh, this was uh, a use case which is getting heavily used in distribution companies. Uh, a lot of customers uh, or a lot of uh, clients have credit approvals uh, defined for their customers. And uh, many times when a credit threshold is exceeded for a customer, the customer sale or sales order goes on a hold. And uh, for the pick back ship process to uh, get executed, the uh, customer order has to be released, in, uh, released from the SAP system. Again, uh, now uh, you have the capability to do that uh, from, from, uh, from our Fiori app. So you can not only view uh, all the orders which are on hold, uh, you can uh, release a particular order uh, uh, if uh, if it is authorized as per the business process. So and I think I understand that the the value of this is also a huge value for the, from the customer end. Yeah, especially it allows uh, you to uh, avoid customer dissatisfaction. Uh, in some cases, it even um, is is a solution for potential revenue loss, correct? Mm -hmm. Because if you don't approve your orders on time, uh, you are going to not uh, be able to uh, ship your goods, provide your services. And uh, it is a revenue loss as well as uh, it's a question of uh, making customers unhappy in some cases. And again, this is available on both iOS and Android platforms. Yes, and that is uh, another uh, very good feature uh, about uh, all of our solutions. Uh, so since our apps are natively built, um, they use the Fiori uh, design principles. And at the same time, um, they work on both the leading Android as well as iOS platform. Great. Thank you. Okay, let's move on to the next app again before we go into the demo. So our data visualization app, and again, I've heard that there's a challenge. Um, to access the SAP Lumira stories securely, um, and this allows people on the go to do that on this app. Yes, this is a very, very unique app which we uh, have. Uh, 
And again, this is uh, being uh, used at uh, quite a few clients. Uh, for for uh, as many of the participants in this call uh, would probably know, uh, SAP Lumera is an on-premise solution. And uh, SAP Lumera is uh, used by a lot of customers for their uh, data visualization uh, a part of the BI analytics. So uh, many customers create storyboards in Lumera, and they use those storyboards for tracking their analytics, tracking their business logic, uh, uh, deciding uh, uh, what what decisions to take uh, in their business. Uh, so uh, what we have done is uh, we now have built an app, uh, which again uh, is a HANA Cloud app. So if you have this app, it goes back and connects to your uh, on-premise uh, SAP Lumera story. And you can launch any of your on-premise SAP Lumera story through our app. In other words, uh, now you have the ability to view uh, all your SAP Lumera stories uh, through, uh, through, a, through a device using cloud. Uh, Nice. And here's and here you can see a quick view of what that looks like. And again, I want to encourage attendees that they can schedule a live demo of these apps, as well as we have a, a free 30-day trial offer. Right. Right. So we we you're right, Tamara. We offer uh, a free trial uh, for all of our uh, potential prospects and customers. Uh, we would uh, love to. Uh, have these apps running uh, with your enterprise SAP, and uh, you can uh, see the power, the capability, the flexibility mm -hmm. these solutions bring uh, to the table. And again, this is an out-of-the-box app, but it can be customized to a client's needs, their business needs. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, a lot of clients are uh, using their uh, branding uh, uh, corporate branding for these apps. Uh, uh, there are different ways and uh, customers uh, want these apps to be deployed based on their current, uh, currently implemented uh, systems. So uh, based on our experience, almost uh, every client is very unique in terms of how they run their business. So the apps are very flexible and uh, we can always uh, do the necessary uh, tweaks uh, to make sure that they fit uh, your uh, unique scenario. Right. Now, um, Anil's going to prepare to launch into a live demo of the PO approval app. The very first thing you need to do is uh, it is tightly integrated with SAP Cloud Identity Services. So you don't need to uh, invest in any new identity service provider or anything like that. Uh, we can uh, log in uh, to the app with a simple S user ID. And once you log into the uh, app, uh, it will ask you for your actual uh, SAP uh, user ID. So once we uh, log in, uh, you will be able to see um, all the purchase orders which are uh, awaiting uh, nice. your, your action, right? And uh, the nice thing we have in our, all our apps is that all our apps have inbuilt visualization. So when you come to the landing page, uh, you can see the visualizations which tell you uh, the critical aspects of your uh, business data at a go. And uh, from there, you can drill into any more details as required. Uh, so you can click on a particular uh, purchase order uh, which you want to approve. You can look at the critical data points uh, which are relevant uh, to you. Uh, so, so that is how um, this app works. Uh, it is uh, very easy to use, very, very uh, what I call user friendly, mm -hmm. uh, and a lot of the senior. Uh, uh, team members in, in organizations who, who usually uh, are on the move 
or uh, are not very tax savvy, but they really need to be able to see the business data quickly and uh, right. act on it. And so I for them, this, this integrates is, with their desktop, with the other SAP devices, and so you're actually in sync with all of your business needs, which is really nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's that's correct, uh, and all those uh, those uh, features uh, make this and other solutions we have built very, very uh, user-friendly, very efficient, and uh, very, very easy to deploy. So I'm going to switch off over now. People, I want to, again, remind you, you can send questions, and Neil can answer your questions. The first question, which we get for every webinar, is, is this presentation available? And I, um, if you'd like, please send a request to marketing at charterglobal.com, and we can give you a copy of this. Anil, are you ready to take a few questions? Yeah, let's let's take uh, a couple of them and um, uh, and then see uh, what questions the participants have uh, uh, based okay. on the. Okay. What is the pricing per user after the free trial offer? Um, Anil, do you want to take that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so uh, it's a uh, it's a hard one to be honest. Uh, uh, pricing isn't very uh, very high. Uh, it is. Uh, Basically, um, the way this deployment works is like Uber. Uh, as a customer, <laughs> you don't you don't even need to uh, buy uh, any HANA Cloud platform. You are welcome to uh, do that if you want. Uh, we are uh, we are not actually in the business of selling HANA Cloud platform. Uh, so the way the whole solution works is uh, it is and um, the apps can be deployed. Uh, and consumed by a customer in SaaS model. So uh, SAP provides the cloud environment. Uh, we uh, deploy the apps on that cloud environment. Uh, we can even maintain that environment for the customer uh, if if uh, if they don't want to own any of uh, those uh, technical activities. So pricing is usually based on per user. Uh, there is a, a, a what I call a least minimum uh, number of users which will be built irrespective of how many users actually use the app. Right, so, and I uh, encourage I, people also to look at the yeah. free 30-day free trial offer. This is for the out-of-the-box app. It does not include modifications, which of course most people understand and that would be discussed after the free trial. We have some more questions. Let's see. Um, Oh, interesting. Okay. First, somebody wants to know if we have any major oil and gas customers. I think we do have some energy clients. If you go to our customer case studies and our industry page, there are some links there to those case studies. Do you know if we have right. any others? Um, yeah. Anil? Uh, so for the Fury apps, uh, we don't have uh, a working uh, oil and gas uh, customer uh, to reference. But as a as a company which has a big, much bigger, wider portfolio, right. we do have uh, customers in that space as well. Okay, good question here. How does the approval PO app differ from the standard SAP app? So, uh, in terms of functionality, uh, uh, obviously the approval is not going to be different, right? But uh, how it differs is as follows: one. Our app uh, has notification process inbuilt, uh, so it's a mobile notification, uh, and the notification is delivered through HANA Cloud uh, platform mobile service. So that is one of the differentiation. Second differentiation is, uh, as you saw in the recorded video, uh, our app has the inbuilt visualizations or a BI analytic, whatever term you want to use. So that's another huge differentiation. Good. Another another differentiation in uh, the apps we have, we have the badge count functionality. Like uh, we use so many apps in our daily daily use, which are more on the consumer side. Mm -hmm. So uh, when you get a notification, you will see uh, the uh, app get a uh, number two or number three, which means oh, you have three notifications pending. So a lot of uh, the features which we have built uh, are are um, are based on the best user experiences we have right. uh, 
uh, in our consumer grade uh, apps. So and we brought all note those. Here, Charter Global those is also a SAP Edge partner, and and we're involved actively involved in that program. So we are partners with SAP. Um, right, right. Move on to the next question. Again, somebody asked this earlier, but I think it would be good to visit revisit it. Is what is a typical implementation timeline for the apps and the solutions? Uh, so honestly, as I said, uh, it's not uh, it's not more than few weeks. Uh, mm -hmm. All we need to do is uh, uh, migrate a uh, few. Um, back-end services to your SAP system. Uh, I, I would be uh, sticking my neck out here and say no more than six weeks uh, unless you really want a lot of customizations. Right, to get them on up, modifications, correct. Yeah, to get them up and running during a free trial um, connected to our system, mm -hmm. uh, just a couple of weeks. Okay. That's good. That, which leads nicely into the next question. Um, is there any limit on the number of users that can access the apps? Uh, no. We want to be uh, very broad-based. Uh, we are not putting any significant restrictions. Um, uh, but uh, please, uh, we don't want to deploy the apps to thousands of users because it's just going to take a lot of time uh, mm -hmm. for, for, for our team to do that. Uh, to answer your question again, no. Uh, it could be one user, it could be three users, it could be five users. We would be glad to uh, work uh, a specific scenario uh, with you guys. Right. Okay. And just two more questions. Let's see. Do we need to have the SAP HANA database or HANA S4 for the solution to work? No, not at all. Um, that is uh, that is what really confuses a lot of potential. Uh, customers who look at these solutions. No, you don't need a HANA database at all, SAP HANA database. Uh, uh, actually, uh, recently SAP um, has listened to customer voice once again, mm -hmm. and they have uh, rebranded this platform to SAP Cloud Platform. They have taken the word HANA out because um, it uh, confuses a lot of people. Right. So far, uh, for our apps, there is no HANA database involved, so you don't need to have a subscription to HANA database on the cloud uh, at all. Uh, you don't need it, nor do you need to be an S4, uh, SAP HANA S4 uh, uh, implementation. Uh, ECC6 is fine. If you are on HANA S4 already, that's fine too. So uh, all we need is uh, an SAP cloud platform uh, to run uh, these apps. Great, and that again leads into a, another question here, and I think that unless you have any further questions, please submit them now, and we'll end with this one if not. Uh, Anil, do you offer a bundled one-stop solution, app plus HANA cloud platform? Yes, as I uh, said uh, uh, a short while earlier, uh, we do offer uh, a bundled solution, and that's actually how this offering is designed. Uh, we uh, not only uh, deploy the app, uh, we configure it uh, to your needs. Uh, we work with SAP to uh, get the uh, SAP Cloud Platform. So we have uh, all the paperwork. Uh, we are a one-stop shop. And you as a customer just enjoy the Uber, right? So you <laughs> nice. don't need you don't need to uh, really worry about uh, how uh, who owns the infrastructure, how is it working, right? Uh, and that's that's how the solution works. Okay, and if we have no further questions, I want to remind people that this is the first in a lunchtime webinar series. The next one is Thursday, May 25th, again a lunchtime series, where we're going to provide an overview of our over 30 JD Edwards apps. And again, if you want to learn more about these, there's a nice overview on our website. And again, these offer have a free 30-day trial offer. Um, any other questions or comments, Anil? No, uh, I I, um, I um, don't have uh, a lot of other comments to offer. Okay. Uh, Thank you for joining us today from Denver. Um, and again, I want to encourage people to um, send us a line at ERP Solutions uh, at charterglobal.com, and we can send you a copy of the presentation. 
and this has been recorded and will be available on our website. My name is Tamara Hyatt, and I'm with Charter Global. Thank you for joining us today. Have a good day.